All right, I wasn't going to record tonight. I'm back here at the school I was at yesterday. I found a couple dollars in change so far. A bunch of kids here that I want to record earlier. But it's got a slamming signal. And of course, we got to let the food fly. Let's get this done. I don't know if it's silver, but it ran up in the high 80s. Let's go and see what we got, and uh, then I'll fool it off. Let's go look. What we got here? All right. Let me pop my glasses on real quick, see if I can see any kind of maker's mark on this thing. All right, I'll get right back at you. Hold on. I just wanted to film it real quick so in case it was something good, but I don't think it is. I don't see no marks. Nice and heavy. It looks like there's some kind of a copper or something showing through there. It's just plated. Oh well, on to the next. Later. Alrighty, real quick. Got myself another key. Woohoo. Alright. It says something on it. Do not duplicate. I guess I can't make a copy of this then, huh? All right, I'll get back to you in the next. Ooh, that jar's gonna be full before I know it. All right, talk to you soon. Okay, real quick wrap up. Same stuff, square tabs. Got a lock nut for uh, electrical stuff there. Tube of something. Button, epic threads. Epic threads. A button or a snap or something. Uh, I have to wash that off and keep that. Alright. Now for some of the good stuff. Hold on. Alright, real quick. I just got uh, seven quarters, six dimes, six nickels, uh, 13 pennies, and three zinc pennies. Alright, that was a little junker. I don't know if it's a pendant or an earring. It could have been a pendant, I guess. It broke off. Just plated copper. And then my key, S4. Ooh, do not duplicate this S4, whatever you do. Alright, now stay tuned for some real cool stuff. I didn't find it, I bought it. But check it out, you might enjoy it. Later. Alrighty, guys, just want to share with you real quick. I finally went to silver.com uh, to check out what they have for sale. and. I checked out a couple of the copper things they had. They had some copper rounds, they call them. And they're the size of a like dollar coin, but they're copper. They're like a buck a piece, maybe a buck ten or something. I forget what I paid for them now. But they're gorgeous. They have the uh, you know, the buff, the uh, Morgan, the Drape Bust, or that's a oh, Cat Bust. The Stand in Liberty, the Merc. I forgot what they call that one. There's a Peace Dollar. Walking Liberty. That one. I got a, a couple other ones coming too. There's another Trade Dollar one and something else. But, for 10 uh, or 12 bucks, whatever, for 10 big copper coins like that, well worth it. Shiny. They got stuff on the back too. I'll flip them over. Really pretty. Brand new. I decided I'm going to get... Oh, I can't say. Right now, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> anyway, I'm sure you guys get the gist of it. But, uh, these are cool coins. And of course, how can you go to silver.com and not buy any silver? So not only did I get these copper coins, I got a couple of troy ounce, one ounce coins. The uh, Seated and the Walking Liberty. They're gorgeous. Just unbelievable. One Troy ounce, 0.99 fine silver. Alright, beauteous. And, you know me, I had to get me one of these too. Five Troy ounce silver bar. It's thick. It's heavy. Ooh. Pretty neat. They make a 10 a ten ounce one too, I think. Copper, I think they make it in like 10 pound 
H bars or something too. These coys are awesome. Make a great gift. So hey, go check them out. Silver.com. They got copper, silver, gold, you name it. Awesome coins though. Alright. We'll catch you later. Have a great night.